everyone, this is watched. Recently, unusual events have been happening in Tinio. Russians are despised and banned more than usual, and raiders from different countries are raging on YouTube and Discord. Since Mountain General and Slack Jod have already told everything, I decided to give a brief summary of the information for my comrades. This video will be very very short, probably. The main news is that Tinio is falling apart. Pacifica and Panzer, these are the main developers by the way, are gone. The leaders of development change a hundred times a day, but most importantly, they try to blame the Russians for all of this, which I'm already quite tired of. They think that the Russians are the demons that make this fandom suffer. They try to deceive everyone and even lie. That that everything is fine. They even lied to everyone on my channel. After talking with my comrades, I learned that the address of Pacifica, as well as her photo, was leaked to the internet, so she left with Panzer and a bunch of developers, after which there was only a power vacuum. Photo of Pacifica was posted exactly a week after the closure of the old Tinio Redux by her friend Nath. So some of the developers decided to take revenge, which I consider to be fair enough because of endless sursophobia and killing of some Tinio Samut. Hear my message, comrades. Tinio is in a state of real civil war. Your choice is who to believe, but the developers are openly lying to us and some even agree with them. Don't be their puppets. Have your head on your shoulders. Think and only then make a choice. Thanks to the videos of Slackjot and Mountain General, which I have already mentioned, it becomes obvious that the developers are conducting their vile and pathetic raids on YouTube and Discord. Oh, they even tried to hack Mountain General. By the way, it is possible that they will get to me. They try to calm everyone down, but I think that truth is on side of Tinio Redux. Just be aware of Tinio developers, that's all.